Thanks for joining us and today we're going to be building a vinyl picket fence. The first thing you want to do is establish all of your ends and corner post. We've got our hole dug so we're just filling the hole with concrete. Now we're going to drive the post down into the concrete keeping the bottom hole two inches above the ground. If you have smaller animals, you can go lower. Level the post. Make sure you level both sides of the post. Now we have a short section here. So we want to make sure that that's going to be level. Keep the top level. You can do this with a large level or the way we're doing it with a post and a smaller level. Either one works. For this section, we're going to have a 36 inch gate and one panel. Make your measurements and then get your next corner or end post in. Fill that hole with concrete and then drive it down to about two inches above the ground. Then you'll level it up. Now we're going to go to the gate post. This will be our hinging post. We're just siding it in. You can use a string if you'd like. Make sure you get your opening. From inside to inside it has to be exact. And then we're going to level the top as well. Now this piece of steel is for the hinging post of your gate. Fill the inside up with concrete to ground level. Make sure you do not go above the bottom rail. Still is a must for the gates. A vinyl post alone is not strong enough to hold the weight. We're going to move on to our next line. This one happens to work out to be exactly five panels, so we've already set our end post. And we're kicking six foot centers. Now that they've been kicked out, we're just going to spot where the holes are going to go. Again, we do this by eyesight. If you'd like to run a string, then that works as well. Now, on this particular project, you'll notice the ground is flat and then it makes a, a break and goes uphill. So we need to put in a grade post. This is going to break the top of our fence so it runs flat and then flows with the ground. We've sided it in. We're going to fill it with concrete. We'll level it and side it into our line. And then start with our first line post. Now everything has been measured out to work out exactly at six foot centers. We'll side it in. We're going to shoot our top straight to our first grade pole. Luckily there's only two breaks in this ground that makes it much easier. Side our post in, level it, make sure it's in line. And then when you go back, you can see how we've created this slope so it breaks up. And this next line is going to run straight on top. And for more tutorials, or the second part of this tutorial, visit our website at wholesalevinylfencing.net.